There have never been more Catholics on Earth than there are right now. But in the Western world, in Europe, North America, and Australasia, the faith is declining so fast that its extinction actually seems possible. What will happen to the faith in our part of the world? Will the light stay on? Or will we descend into darkness? The new evangelization is a term used for the attempt to stop this decline. In this rapidly changing world, the survival of the faith will depend on the efforts of Catholic laity to promote and spread it. But this might not be a very easy task. Let me, let me give you an example of why. Here is Inibu. And five years ago, today in fact, I gave my life over to Inibu. I started a, a personal relationship with Inibu. Inibu who loves me unconditionally. Inibu who has guaranteed me eternal life. Inibu which has given me a happiness and a joy that I could never receive anywhere else. Inibu who has given me a code by which I can live my life and has inspired me to help the poor and the downtrodden and the marginalized. And in these past five years of my relationship with Inibu, I haven't been attacked by a single hippopotamus. Now, the point I'm making is that pretty much anything you or any other Christian can tell me about Jesus Christ, I can tell you about Inibu, and I can add in protection from hippopotamus attacks. Now, you might say, that's crazy, you can't compare the two things. Well, to a significant minority of people in the Western world, belief in Jesus Christ is just as irrational as belief in Inibu. Now, this is the problem that we have, because when we look at the studies that tell us why people have left the church, why people are not coming to church, when we look at the, at the, at the, at the studies which show why religious disaffiliation, movement away from the church, has reached an epidemic, that's what we keep coming back to. What we keep coming back to is people stop finding it believable. In response to this, we at Atlantic School of Theology have developed a diploma program in the new evangelization. This program seeks to train agents of the new evangelization, lay Roman Catholics who can challenge these accounts of history, who can challenge these understandings of what is rational to believe and what isn't, who can proclaim the gospel in persuasive, convincing and coherent ways in the 21st century. Have you got a role to play in the new evangelization and will being trained for that role at Atlantic School of Theology help you become what you are being called to be? Now, for the remainder of this video, I'm going to speak a little bit about the program, but much more importantly, I'm going to ask graduates to tell you about their experience of the diploma program. And hopefully after listening to them, you might feel inclined to sign up for this program. If so, all the details will be later on in this video. The Diploma of the New Evangelization was probably one of the best programs I've ever, ever done. I came to it as a new Catholic with very, very little knowledge. And um, what it did was that it not only increased my faith, but it enabled me to speak about my faith in a way that I never thought I ever could or ever would. The new evangelization is giving us a clearer glimpse into our faith and pushing through to see exactly what that faith is. The new evangelization program was just fascinating. Um, for me, it was going deeper in faith, but I, I remember sitting in classes often saying, I, why didn't I know that? I, I just, I learned so much about the faith and, and that to me was just uh, wonderful. Uh, I entered with trepidation. <laughs> I went because in my heart, I always wanted to learn about theology. It changed me in a good way. It gave me confidence to, 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 to live my faith uh, boldly and without making excuses or apologizing. This is what I believe and this is what I try to live by. For me, it was a really good challenge in intellectual stimulation and growing in my understanding of the faith. Students who take the diploma program learn about Catholic apologetics, that is, explaining and defending Catholic positions in the wider world. 
They learn to fall in love with scripture. They learn about leadership and the beauty of Catholic social teaching. We asked some of our grads which courses stood out for them. It was the new evangelization course, yeah. That course introduced me to Bishop Barron through, through his essays on new evangelization. Was, it, was, it was overwhelming at first, but it was, it was really a fun read and fun, uh, uh, fun things to learn about the Catholic faith. One of the components was apologetics, which just meant explaining why the Catholic Church believes what they believe. And, and, and that's really important because I think over the generations, we've lost some of that ed basic education in Catholicism. There was one semester was beautiful. We cover the Gospel of Luke and, and Acts. So that, that is magnificent. My absolute favorite course was the course on Catholic apologetics. Um, why apologetics? Because it explains and defends our faith, and I, I needed that both to establish the truth that I knew within and to be able to speak the truth to others. The pastoral learning, uh, I learned about Catholic social teaching, which is something I didn't, I had no clue about, but it was such an eye-opening course. Also the courses on scripture, we covered uh, Matthew and Luke. So looking at the historical context, the literal context, and um, the spiritual senses of scripture, none of which I knew before um, and totally enriched my understanding of, 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 of Jesus in the Gospel. It's wonderful to hear the impact that learning has had on our grads, but we were also thrilled to hear what they said about the relationships they built in the program, whether they took the courses on campus or on Zoom. One of the things I got out of the program was a whole bunch of new friends. The main thing um, I loved was meeting other people other Catholics, um, which all wanting from different backgrounds, wanting to share our faith, wanting to learn, wanting to grow, and wanting to contribute. It's also the fact that you get to meet like-minded individuals, like granted that we've had these two COVID years where we've only met online, but you get to meet like-minded individuals and have these passionate discussions with them. So that's, that's another thrill altogether that we are together in this, that we are, uh, that we're brave. And it's not easy to talk about faith. I, I, I think everybody, it, because it's very, very personal. And, and so when you, in the small group discussions, if you're going to get the most out of the course, you've got to open up and you've got to be a little bit vulnerable. And, and so, number one, I, I made wonderful connections with other people I, who have strong Catholic faith. I enjoyed the program thoroughly. Um, for me, it was a really good challenge in intellectual stimulation and growing in my understanding of the faith, and also a really good opportunity to get to know other people from across the Archdiocese who have similar interests. And you know, also knowing those people, the committed people in the program, helps me understand that I'm not alone. The diploma program is an amazing intellectual and social experience, which helps you share the Catholic faith and play your role in the new evangelization. If you're in the Archdiocese of Halifax, Yarmouth, then thanks to the support of the Patrick Parr Trust, you can take the program free of charge. If you'd like to apply, the email address will be at the end of this video. And if you're somewhere else in the world, just email me and we can chat about how you can participate. But before then, let's hear a final word, the grads that we spoke to earlier this week. I would definitely recommend that people take the, di uh, the Diploma in New Evangelization because it's not every day that you get to learn for free. Okay, and the learning for free and that to getting to learn about your faith for free, it's it's a beautiful, uh, it's a beautiful opportunity that not everybody everywhere in the world is offered. Oh, definitely, I would recommend anyone. Uh, it it changed me in a good way. It gave me confidence. I would highly recommend taking this for anyone who's interested in learning more, in growing deeper in their faith, in meeting others who are of a similar mind. Um, it's a great program, and it's definitely worth your time. I would recommend this course very much to people who want to take their faith to a new level or if they just want a greater understanding of 
what Catholicism is all about. You'll learn more about your faith, you'll meet other Catholics, you'll learn how to share your faith, you'll have fun, and um, what else are you going to do with your Wednesday nights? The application form is just one page long. To receive it or to learn more, just email us at one of the above addresses.